Hi, I'm Rachel and welcome back to my channel where I test things so you don't have to. And today I'm gonna test the things that Amazon said I wanted. A few weeks ago this all started when Amazon said I needed this wiener dog corn dog magnet for my car. You know when you log on to Amazon it says, oh products for you, products we think you'd like, products we think you'd be interested in. And there's 17 different things to say. Our algorithm says you need to buy this. I decided to check on would I actually need these things? Because I would never buy them normally, but maybe Amazon's right. So I bought a bunch of things that Amazon said I would want. But before we test them, let's check to see if we have a sponsor for today. It's time. It's time to get serious about your pleasure. And that's why this video is sponsored by Valesa. My friends at Valesa and I are giving out free vibrators and gift cards to literally everyone who signs up for my giveaway. Valesa is a bi woman company for all things sexuality. So ladies, you know you'll be in good hands. Melissa is on a mission to empower everyone to celebrate and embrace their sexuality. What are these things around me, you may ask? Well, they're the vibrators your body has been waiting for. First, we have the Pebble, a suction and vibration controlled independently, ergonomically built to fit perfectly in your hand. And best of all, there are no annoying patterns. Next up, is my personal favorite, the Air Vibe. Dual stimulation, G-Spot, and Clit. Comes in discreet packaging, waterproof, rechargeable, silent, but deadly. And then there's the Demi Wand. Built for all body types because orgasms are for everyone. And again, waterproof. And don't worry, the neck is flexible, which we all know can help in an intimate moment. The Thrust, a powerful, realistic, Thrusting vibration, five inches that can be inserted, swirling beads at the base of the shaft, USB rechargeable, and of course, waterproof. So don't be afraid to try some new pleasure with some new toys. Hit the link in the description down below and sign up for my giveaway to get yourself a free vibrator gift card. Trust me, you won't be disappointed. And thank you, Belessa, for not just sponsoring this video, you're sponsoring orgasms everywhere. To the rest of the video. This one, the air vibe is actually my favorite. Go check that out, okay. That's all. And we're back. So of course I had to start with the thing that started it all. Amazon said I needed to purchase this. So I did. Do you see it? Do you see it? I have to say, why am I zoomed in all of a sudden? What in the world? I have to say, I think Amazon was right and that I need- Why is the door, is there a ghost? Why is the gate opening ever so slowly? Stop it. Anyway, hi, back to me. I think Amazon was right and that I did in fact need this because who wouldn't? Amazon got this one right. Good job. We've moved on to the bathroom because the next thing Amazon said, this was meant for you was this dolphin hair clip. Oh, oh, there it is. Oh God, no, it gets stuck. Okay, it it has a flaw in the design. It gets stuck. Can we bend it? Are we just gonna, oh, all right. No, it's, it might, it might be a little broken, but that's okay, that's okay. We'll work around it. It gets caught, but that's all right. It's no secret here that I don't know how to do hair, right? Hair products are not for me. That's fine, that's okay. We're just gonna, How did they know that this is exactly what I needed in my life? That this was what was missing from my being? God, they are so smart. It's perfect. Honestly, it just, it couldn't get better than this. I'm so satisfied. Again, another win for Amazon. I am always looking up dolphins and hair clips. Of course they're gonna put it into one. Another win for Amazon, next product. We're not leaving, it's this. Jelly lip melt. Cause I'm always just looking for some jelly on my lips. Who wouldn't want it? Who wouldn't want jelly 
all up on this business. Psh. Maybe it's because they know I like Uncrustables. Have I ever ordered chapstick or any lip product from Amazon? Not in the last six years. Have I ever ordered jelly from them? Nope, but they knew I needed this. With a bouncy jelly texture that melts onto your lips, our Blackberry Jelly Lip Melt will lock and seal moisture while providing a universally flattering, perfectly flushed tint. Twist cap to open, apply an adequate amount to lips. Adequate amount. How am I supposed to know what an adequate amount is? Someone tell me. Oh, she smells good. Oh, she smells good. All right, adequate amount. It is like a, it's, it is bouncy. I'll give it that. Okay, took me a second, I got it. Is that adequate? Oh, oh, she's chunky. Okay, we've chunked it up. That's fine. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm gonna be real, I like it. I'm gonna be real for a moment and say, I like that tent. Hold up, wait a minute. Let me put my two cents in it. Ladies, gentlemen, and all in between, my lips look good. I like this one. Who is she? Oh wait, hold on. Let me get my dolphin out. I'm sorry, dolphin. Uh, me and my dolphin aren't. It's just hold on. Just yes. Oh, there it is. Yes. This is an actual win. <laughs> okay. I'm happy. Next product. We're still in the bathroom because this is the Beechwood Curved Crystal. Crystal? I can't read. Crystal Hair Eraser. Now I shaved my legs today, so we can't test this on my legs. We're gonna test it on my arms because I have hair on my arms and I don't care if it's there or not. So we'll remove it with this. This is a hair remover. Oh, this is terrible. It's a sandy stone that apparently you rub on your skin and it gets rid of hair. Okay, let's see if I can do a close up. I don't know. I don't know. I have hair on my arm. I can see it. I can see my hair. Can you see my hair? I don't think you can see my hair. Okay, I'm just gonna try it and we'll see what happens. Um, yeah, it's definitely shaving down my arm hair. It's just sanding off my hair. Okay, can you see my hair there? Can you see that there's hair on my arm? Please, for the love of God. Okay. It's getting rid of it, but I, it's, it doesn't hurt. I thought it was gonna hurt. It doesn't hurt. Huh. Okay, it doesn't get every hair. It's hard to get all the hair. It was definitely a lot faster to shave and more precise, but okay, this is actually working. This gets rid of your arm hair, but it, I can see it floating in the air. It's just, it's gently sanding the hair off your body. Can you see a difference? This is all smooth right here now. This isn't touched. This has hair and this has all been shaved off. There's still some though. <sighs> There's hair on this. There is some hair on this. I don't know if you can see it. What's the point? To not use razors? Is this supposed to be better for your skin? I feel dehydrated now. I feel rubbed and I am rubbed. Let's put some lotion on. It got the hair off and it didn't hurt. I have no idea if this is better for you than shaving, if it lasts longer than shaving, if it's terrible for you. I have no facts. If you don't like razor blades, but, but if you want it, Beechwood Curved Crystal Hair eraser. It erased my arm hair. Haired? Hair. I'm confused by this. What? Maybe if you're like camping, I don't want to bring a razor? I don't know. I feel exfoliated. Okay. I mean, that one was actually good. Okay, so two were okay, Amazon, and two were like, oh, that I, my lips and that, but yes. Okay, next product. The next product, I truly do not know how this got offered to me as a product I would want or need. I don't know who this is. I also don't like stickers. I get anxiety with them because I have a fear of commitment when it comes to things like this. Where do I stick it? It will be there forever. Will I regret sticking it there? If I don't like it there, I've ruined both the thing it's on and the sticker. It's the same reason I don't have tattoos on my body. Except the one I gave myself when I was a child that's on my knee, because it's a tattoo. 
I don't want to hear anything about it. It seems like a pretty solid sticker. Hello. Why? Why was this suggested to me? I don't know what to do with it. I will never put this anywhere. It cost me cents. Not dollars, but cents. Uh. Next product. Next up is something I obviously needed. No jokes. It is right up my alley. These are salt and pepper shakers. Just putting a little magic on your food. I say we fill them up and see how good they are. Okay. All right, so this is the hole to put the pepper in. You just unscrew. I don't quite know how you would get the pepper in said hole. I guess like this. That doesn't seem very good. Done. Perfect. Let's see how easy it is to get out the pepper. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> oh my God, I thought that was a myth or like something from cartoons that pepper makes people sneeze. I thought that was just a weird thing cartoons did. Like you slip on a banana peel or when you run really fast, your feet go in one spot for a really long time before you actually take off. Oh my God, I feel dumb and betrayed. Okay, oh, here we go. And sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. I, it works. Did they come out like this? Oh, you're pretty good, okay. Oh, did you need some pepper? Well, the pepper fairy is here. I hate me, why'd I do that? Why am I just... Okay, this is cute. I'm definitely gonna give it to Zara, but I did not need this, nor will I ever use this. This is for either people like Zara, who are fairies loving, Unicorn Princess Polly Pocket people, or for children. I am neither, but now I own these. <laughs> yes. This next one looks like maybe it could have been part of the Balesa integration. You will never guess what this is. This is to hollow out your hot dog bun so your hot dog doesn't slip out. Please, for the love of God, watch this tutorial. Um, okay, so I didn't quite know what buns they were working with. We got two types of buns here, all right? We have a typical hot dog bun. I don't know why it's in air quotes, it's an actual hot dog bun. Where you would normally open it, it's a perforated already, where you'd open it right there. I don't know if this is what they're trying to work with, you know, so I'm just gonna stick this. Nope, it just opens it up. Okay, and they're saying that's no good because your dog will slide right out. So the only other buns I think that they would be using would be brioche buns. Well, these are French sourdough rolls. Okay, we'll just work with a big bun, okay? This is uncut. So you're not actually taking bread out, you're just smooshing it. Great, perfect. I'm gonna heat up a hot dog and I'll stick it in. So the big thing is that your condiments won't slide out. So you go, okay. I don't know how that will be dispersed. Now that the hole's lubed up, let's insert the wiener. I had to. I had to. It was right there, okay? And there you have it. A no mess hot dog bun. So much easier than a normal bun. Why would anyone ever use this? Hot dog buns come pre-sliced. I'm so confused. How is this any better than this? Do you not know how to eat a hot dog? It is really simple. I'm the messiest person alive. And I don't make the mess eating a hot dog. Not only did I not need this product, 
but nobody needs this product. All right, those are all the products that Amazon has suggested to me and I decided to buy. They suggest a lot of things to me daily. I am on there constantly, but these were a few that I was like, why? And that were cheap. There were a lot of whys, but were very expensive. I didn't want to break my bank on testing products I, I, I don't actually uh, want, need, or would ever use ever again in my life. We just did the basics, and that's what it was. I don't think Amazon's algorithm is as good as TikToks or Instagrams. Catch up, let's go. All right, but that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you ever want me to test something else, please let me know down below so I can purchase it, I can test it, I can tell you my review. I waste my money so you don't have to waste yours. I love you guys. Please subscribe to see videos every Tuesday on this channel. Make sure you're checking out my vlog channel, my TikTok, my Snapchat, and my Instagram. I love you people. You're wonderful humans. Bye!